alphabet codes, code words, type C. With this type of question, you are normally given the alphabet to help you, but sometimes you won't be. If there isn't an alphabet on your test paper, write one down to help you with these questions. For these questions, you can use the alphabet to work out the code that has been used, and then use this code to read another word. Each question will have one word and the coded version of that word. Using these two words, you need to work out the link between the letters of the word and the letters of the code. After you have the link between the word and the code, the question will ask you to code another word using the same method or decode a word to find the original. How to answer the question? You should write down the code underneath the word with space in between for the rule. Then look at the alphabet and see if you can see any patterns that appear between the letters of the word and the letters of the code. Sometimes in these questions, the pattern will be that the alphabet has been mirrored. The easiest way to solve this code is to write the alphabet backwards underneath the normal alphabet. If you're struggling to find a code that works for your letters by looking for a rule, it might be a mirror code. Try to remember A, Z, B, Y, C, X, and D, W. If you see any of these combinations in your code, it is probably a mirror code. Example. The code for chair is F, K, D, L, U. What is the code for table? For this question, you should write the word and the code underneath it. Word. C, H, A, I, R. Code. F, K, D, L, U. By using the alphabet, you can see that the first letter of the word is C, and that by counting on three letters, it becomes F. The second letter is H, and if you count on three letters, it is K. The third letter is A, and counting on three letters, it becomes D. The fourth letter is I, counting on three letters gives us L. The final letter is R, and by counting on three letters, it becomes U. This means the rule is plus three. Word, chair, C-H-A-I-R, plus three, F-K-D-L-U. Now you know the rule is plus three, it is easy to work out the code for table. Write down the word table with the rule directly underneath it. Word. T-A-B-L-E. Rule plus three. Code. All you have to do now is code each letter in the word using the rule. T plus three is W. A plus three is D. B plus three is E. L plus 3 is O, and E plus 3 is H. Now write down the letters underneath the word and the rule, and you'll have the code W, D, E, O, H. The code for table is W, D, E, O, H. Sometimes you'll be asked to find the word from the code instead of finding a code for the word. What is the word for F, K, D, L, U? This is the opposite of what we have just done, so we have to reverse the rules. This means that plus 3 will be minus 3. Now what you need to do is write down the code and the rule above it. Word. Rule. Minus 3. Code. F. K. D. L. U. Now all you need to do is use the rules to turn the code into a word. So F minus 3 is C. K minus 3 is H, D minus 3 is A, L minus 3 is I, and U minus 3 is R. Write the letters above the code and the rule, and you'll have the word. Word, C H A I R, rule, minus 3, code, F K D L U. Practice questions. Number 1. If the code for nose is M L Q C, what is the code for mouth? What does DYAC mean? Number two. If the code for horse is IPSTF, what is the code for pony? What does EPOLFZ mean? Number three. 
If the code for star is HGZI, what is the code for moon? What does KOZMVG mean? Number 4. If the code for yellow is WCJJMU, what is the code for green? What does MPYLEC mean?